In this example, I need to find the exact value of the cosine of 675 degrees. As the problem says exact value, this means don't use your calculator because it will give you a decimal approximation. I need to use the unit circle shown over here. Now, is 675 degrees an angle on my unit circle? No. All the angles on the unit circle lie between 0 and 360 degrees. So I'm going to have to use my knowledge of coterminal angles to find an angle that is on the unit circle. Now remember, coterminal angles differ by one revolution. And as this problem is in degrees, that means they're going to differ by 360 degrees. And I need an angle smaller than my given angle. So you take your given angle of 675 degrees, you subtract one revolution of 360 degrees. 675 minus 360 is 315 degrees. Now, is 315 degrees on my unit circle? Yes, it's right over here. So I know that the cosine of 675 degrees equals the cosine of its coterminal angle, 315 degrees. As a specific trig function of coterminal angles are always equal. Now I need to use the unit circle to find the cosine of 315 degrees. Remember, here's 315 degrees. The x-coordinate of this point is the cosine of that angle. The y-coordinate of that point is the sine of that angle. I need the cosine of 315 degrees, so that is going to equal the square root of 2 divided by 2. So the exact value of the cosine of 675 degrees equals the square root of 2 divided by 2.